What's going on? Thank you so much for clicking on this video. My name is Ricky Somborn and today's video is going to be really exciting because I went onto Amazon and bought the cheapest ukuleles you can buy. Now let me tell you, they came in the mail and they were definitely very questionable, but they were cheap. I also wanted to throw in some more affordable ukuleles as well that you can most likely play because I have a feeling that you're not going to be able to play the $8 ukulele that I bought. So, I'm not gonna give it any spoilers. Uh, if you like this video, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. Also, if you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button. It's the red icon that looks like this. Click it. Also, if you wanna be notified every single time I upload a video right here on YouTube, make sure to click the bell icon right next to the subscribe icon, and you'll be notified every single time I upload a video. I sound like a grade A YouTuber. Mm. Yes. All right, so without further ado, let's go into the cheapest ukuleles you can buy on Amazon. So one of the cheapest ukuleles you could buy on Amazon was this ukulele. I wanna say thing, but it's a ukulele. Uh, you definitely cannot play it because the, it just doesn't, you can't turn these like tuners and it just doesn't tune. So that's the best it's gonna be. Let me see if you can hear it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> But I mean, it was $8.94, so you can't really, I guess, complain. I mean, I did buy it, so it's my money kind of down the drain because this is just gonna hang on my shelf or stay on my shelf. Does it hang or stay on my shelf? I don't know. It's gonna be in the background. There we go. The next cheapest ukulele that I found on Amazon was this one, which was a really interesting shape. I don't know if you can see that, but it has a little bit of a design here of a palm tree, and it's definitely really interesting looking. Um, but again, this is... You can't tune it, <laughs> which kind of sucks. Um, but it's 17 inches, and it says it's the Beistel 58... Five... What? 50,820 coconut ukulele. Uh, I don't know what that means, um, but that's a really long number for such a small ukulele. But this is it. This was $10.17. Uh, again, you can't play it. But I guess it's something to look at. So that's something. So the next ukulele that I found on Amazon was this one, and I really did have high hopes for this one because it does look like you could play it, but you can't um, really tune it. This is the best that you'll be able to tune it, which isn't, you know, the GCEA tuning. So um, I guess this is another novelty one. It does say on the packaging that it is only for novelty and you can't really play it, but this one is called the Blue Floral Kaiki ukulele, also 17 inches. Uh, it's really cool. I do like the flowery design. So if you'd want something to kind of decorate and just kind of put on a shelf, this would be another one. But again, this is almost $20. If I was gonna spend $20 on a ukulele, I would hope that you could kind of sort of play it, but this, you can't really play. It's not gonna sound the greatest. So, would I buy it? Probably not, but joke's on me, I already bought it and it's here. So, um, another shelfer, for sure. Okay, next. So now that we've gone through the cheapest ones, I wanted to look for more affordable ukuleles that you could actually play because, I mean, if you're looking for a ukulele that's not expensive to play, like if I just showed you the ones that you couldn't play, like the, it'd just be pointless. So I wanted to go into the more affordable ukuleles that you can actually play. So the next one is this one, which I thought looked really cool. It's the Vorsen ukulele, and it is actually a concert-sized ukulele, which I was really surprised uh, at the price and also for that you get a concert-sized ukulele. Like, it was pretty shocking when I saw it, so I definitely had to get it. So this one was $24.99. Uh, for a concert size ukulele, that's like kind of unheard of, but when I opened it and I start playing it, you know, I realized that it is a $25 ukulele. Uh, the entire body is, it's plastic. The strings, um, you know, they're not the most comfortable, but it actually did tune. 
So the sound quality, I wouldn't say is the greatest, but again, it's $25. Like you can't really complain too much about the sound when a ukulele, concert ukulele is $25. It does have a sort of like buzzy um, sound. I think it's just because the entire body is plastic. So it's kind of vibrating throughout the ukulele. But it's not the worst, but not the best. Uh, let me play a little bit to show you how it sounds. So again, the sound isn't the greatest, but it's not the worst. I mean, you are, it is $25, so you couldn't really go wrong with it. Would I recommend this ukulele? Definitely. I think if somebody is just starting out and they're not really sure if they like the ukulele or if they would even be into it after they bought the ukulele, I would definitely suggest this one. Obviously, it's not the best quality ukulele and sound, but I think for a beginner who's just wanting to learn and not really want to invest in a $200, $300 ukulele, I think this is the one for you. Also, if you have kids and you're worried of them breaking it, this one, I don't really think you can break that easily. I don't know. I haven't like smashed it over a counter yet. Yeah, I would definitely recommend this one. I think this is a really great ukulele for an amazing price and it's a concert size so it's a bigger size so i'm definitely pleasantly surprised about this one 25 dollars for concert ukulele you can also choose different colors i think they had red yellow green i went with black because i liked how it looked i'll also make sure to include a link to every ukulele that i talk about in the description below so definitely go check them out it's a direct link to the amazon page that i went and bought it so you can you know read more about it yourself or you know if you're interested in getting one of these you know, you have that direct link. So 25 bucks, I don't mind it. It's not my favorite, but again, 25 bucks, I'll take it. I mean, I guess I, I did take it because I bought it, but you know. So the next Duke is a little bit more expensive, but again, the price is pretty cheap for what you would pay for a higher quality ukulele. So this one is the Hurricane ukulele. It is concert size. Uh, this was $65.99, so essentially $66. Um, it plays really nicely. I would definitely switch out the strings. The strings aren't the most comfiest to play. Um, I'll put a recommendation for strings down below as well. Uh, the next one that I'm actually going to show you, I actually changed the strings out. Um, so stay tuned for that. But this one, I mean, this, this the strings that it came with, it's pretty nice. It is the... Concert size professional ukulele starter, small guitar, Hawaiian guitar bundle with gig bag. That is the title for this ukulele, how they sold it on Amazon. Definitely a very long winded keyword stuffed title. But again, the quality, not bad. The sound, let's test it out. So if you guys have followed me on Instagram previously, you'll know that I've actually played this ukulele a bunch. Um, I really do like it. The tuning, it took a while for it to stay in tune. So that was kind of a little bit of an issue. Again, the strings aren't the comfiest. Um, so I would definitely switch them out. But again, for $66, I think it's a solid ukulele. It has some design on the body and it's, a, it's an interesting looking ukulele. So would I recommend this? Definitely, I think this is a great ukulele for beginners. And again, it is a concert size ukulele, so it's bigger, 66 bucks. 
sound quality is pretty awesome it, it does definitely projects and it's loud um, but yeah I would definitely change the strings out with this one just because um, there's a lot more comfier strings out there and especially if you're a beginner uh, you definitely don't want such a, a hard string on your fingers because one that's gonna make you not want to play as much because your fingers will hurt and two it's just it's it sounds more fuller with other ukulele strings in my opinion uh, but yeah I'll put a link to this one as well highly recommend the hurricane concert size ukulele so last but definitely not least, this is honestly one of my favorite ukuleles that I've ever actually bought. And it is this one, which is the Flight Tenor Ukulele. The number for this one is the NUT310. And it is really, really beautiful, I think. Uh, the headstock is really nice. It has the Flight logo. And on the body, you have sort of some design right here. The strings that it came with were really comfortable. But since this was one of my favorite ukuleles to hold and to play, I decided that I wanted to put some new strings on it, some low G strings on it, because for me and you know when I sing, the lower G string sound is a lot better in my opinion for my voice. So I did change those out, but the strings that it came with were really comfortable and they actually sounded amazing. I was like contemplating if I should switch them out just because I really did love those strings. But anyways, I did put new strings on this one just because this is a special ukulele and I wanted it to just be enhanced that much more. The strings that I used on here were the Diderio low G string ukuleles. I'll put a link to that as well down below. Honestly, one of my favorite um, just ukulele strings on the market so far for me. Uh, I just really enjoy the sound and the richness that it gives to each ukulele. One of the things that I really found impressive about flight ukes in general, now I have multiple, but this was the first flight ukulele that I ever purchased. And what I noticed right off the bat is when he took it out of the box and he started to tune it, it literally took like 30 seconds for it to stay in tune, which is honestly like pretty unheard of. Uh, you usually have to play it, you know, throughout the day and, you know, let the strings loosen up and, you know, for it to just really stay in tune. But this literally took like 30 seconds to a minute. It was so quick, right out of the box, it was pretty much ready to go. Um, so that was one of the things I thought was super, super impressive. So let's give it a sound test, shall we? So that is the sound of this one. I really do love it. It projects beautifully. The tone and the sound of it is just so rich. Um, again, different strings, so it's a little bit lower, but yeah, it's, it's so beautiful sounding. And the ukulele itself really does project the sound and it's, the quality is there and it was, I forgot to even tell you how much it was. It was 80 bucks on Amazon that I found it. And it honestly is one of my favorite ukuleles. And it's 80 bucks, pretty affordable for a tenor size. This is a tenor size ukulele, 80 bucks. You can't beat this ukulele. Uh, I also put the link to their website um, so directly so you can see other ukuleles that they have. They have amazing travel size ukuleles that just are so freaking beautiful. <laughs> I don't even know how they do it. Uh, they also have higher quality ukuleles and then also mid-range. So definitely go check it out. I'll put a link. Uh, it'll be the first link for that one just so you can see the different types because this honestly is one of my favorite uh, brand of ukuleles to play so far. I have now a few and each one literally is just gets more and more amazing. So definitely highly recommend Flight Ukulele because their, their ukes are just you can tell that they put a lot of time and effort and just thought into every ukulele. So highly, 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 highly 
recommend this one. So uh, that is it. Yeah, that was actually a bunch of ukuleles that I bought. Now I am poor, so make sure to <laughs> like this video. It really does help with uh, people finding this video. Also, if you haven't already and you've watched this entire video, uh, and you haven't subscribed yet, what are you doing? Click the subscribe button below. It looks a bit like this. Click it, it'll turn gray. And also, if you want to be notified every single time I upload a video right here on YouTube, make sure to hit the bell icon right next to the subscribe icon. And that would be amazing. You'd be doing me a... I can't speak. You'd be doing me a solid favor. Um, but yeah, so that is it for this video. Hopefully you liked it. Hopefully you found some more information on some cheap, affordable ukuleles that you can buy on Amazon. I am going to go because I need to edit this video and I also need to walk my dogs because they're probably waiting. They're like, Ricky, where are you at? We need to go pee and poop. So I'm going to do that. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye everybody.